Well, hello there, ladies and gents. I'm Tammy Sipniewski, and thank you so much for coming by my channel. So in this video, I'm going to quickly teach you how to use text masking in LumaFusion, and it's super simple, so let's dive right into it. And we're off. Okay, let's get started. Let's launch LumaFusion. Now let's import a video to work with or photo if you want to use this method for a thumbnail. This one looks good. Now let's drop that into our timeline. Double tap on that and that is going to bring us to the properties window. Now let's do a little color correction to get this to look more cinematic. Add some contrast, bump up the saturation and the vibrance. Okay, now let's drop a LUT over this to make it look even more punchy. Okay, now I did this in 60 frames per second, knowing that I would slow this down. So let's go ahead and tap on the speedometer icon to change the speed and just drag this down to 40%. That looks good. Okay, nice and smooth. That looks good. So now what we want to do is add a title here. Choose titles. And let's choose the plain white title and just drop that right over our timeline. And we're just going to pull that out as long as we think we may want it. And we can always change it if it needs to be longer or shorter. Double tap on that and that's going to bring us to the properties window. So double tap on the title and that brings us to the edit window. And this is going to allow us to type in whatever we want for the title here. So text masking. Next step is to change the font. Pick a nice bold font. Hmm, this one looks pretty bold. Now let's increase the size of this. Make it nice and big. Okay, now what we want to do is change the line spacing to move this closer together. And just drag this around to see what looks best. And that looks pretty good. Okay, now what we want to do is change the font to a green color. So go to face color and choose green. Now what we want to do is add a shape to this. So go ahead and hit the plus icon. Choose shape. And this is going to give us options for a shape, but just use both your fingers to pull this out to make the square cover the entire window here. And what we want to do now is change the color to black. That looks good. The next step is to move the shape value line above the title value line. So click on the end where those three lines are. Just click on that, hold it down, drag it, hold it on top, and just release it. And there you go. Okay, so what we want to do now is turn the green lettering into a chroma key value or green screen element. And we do that by tapping the color and effects icon and choose the key icon for chroma key or green screen. Then choose green screen and boom, there you go. Okay, so let's hit play and you can see the video playing through your text. Listen, I probably could have picked a better video here, something lighter on both ends. This way you could have seen it a little better. It may not be translating so well, but you get the general idea. Your video is playing through that text. And you're done. And that's how simple it is to do text masking in LumaFusion. So if you haven't already, please hit subscribe. And if you found this video helpful, please give me a thumbs up. And until next time, wear your sunblock.